Hello, this is Lime from the NRL Credit One Bank Cup Series. We're running a race for, in Season 1, the Denver 300 from the Denver Motorsports Park Oval. Here's the starting lineup for today's race. Antoine Charles, or Antonin Charlebois, uh, I'm sorry, I've been butchering that. Trey Smith, Rod Hayes, Christian Elder, Nelson Reeves, Ricky Freeman Jr., Jay Jefferson, Marcus Sachi, Landon Smith Jr., last race's winner, uh, David Haas, Brett Sierra, Joshua Tepensaw, Brandon Yodel, Cade Malin, Renato Moreno, Owen Finley, Brandon Beal, Gil Williams, Dan Harrison, Carabell, Juan Rodriguez, William Brock, Cole Raymond, Roy Rippleton, Jack Rippleton, Riley Spurley too, Griffin Lynn, Christian Vargas, Code Red, Matthew Burnett, Stephen Colin, Nathan Stapleton, uh, Carter Joey, Owen Miles, Mitchell Collins, Marcus Wells, Jose Mills, Diego Yupes, Ryder Chisholm, Audra Baranowskis, Joshua Harrison, and rounding out the field is Peter Onjak in the 78 car. And the command to fire the engine. There we go. Now they're gonna start pulling off and we will go ahead and get to start the race. 18 laps here today at Denver Motorsports uh, Oval Park. Anthony Charbois looks to further his points gap in between second place and points. And it looks like he has a good chance to do it. Let's see how far he this race at the Oval. So the pace car will peel in and going down this long stretch, we will get ready to go green flag racing for the Denver 300. Into the restart zone we go. And Christian Elder pulls high. So green flag is now out. Lot 118 is underway. Elder one three wide. Elder on the top, Smith in the middle, and Charles Watt at the bottom. Rockies pulls out. Leaves a big gap for Anthony and Charles Bois. Big thing about this is everyone is gonna need to try and catch up to each other. They're gonna have to try and catch up. As yeah, this is a fast track. You see, they're going 218 miles per hour into the corner. Fastest lap in the 40 seconds. Running. Where's Carbell running? Carbell is currently 27. So if you get a good lap time, uh, you should take a while for to get out here if you can. Uh, anyways, up front, pass for the lead. That's Trey Smith on the bottom. That's not Brandon Gold. On pit road, looks like he never even had to Second off, Trey Smith. Into turn three they go. Anthony and Charbois did not have a very good start to the season. You remember race one, he uh, got in that wreck and then recently he's just been turning it around. Had a good finish at Pocono, finished second. Uh, then at, uh, then at, uh, then at uh, Denver, the Roval, his caution is out on the track. It's like maybe go right. Anyway, you were talking, he had a good finish at the Denver Motorsports Roval. Uh, 
And yeah, that's what gave him the points lead. So let's take a look at the caution. Ah, uh, so yeah, just just a simple bump draft gone wrong. So there. Ashton is out for the first time today. So catch up with everyone. They're gonna fly. Top 10 right now Char is Tarbois, Trey Smith, Nelson Reeves, Rick Green, Jr., David Hodge, Dr. Rita, Sachi, Dr. Cage, Christian Elder, and last race is winner. And wrecking, that's Jack Rivelton, saves it for the most part, and it's the big one at Denver. Griffin Land, Code Red, Ryder Chisholm, Riley Spurley, Two Peter on Jack, everyone involved, Christian Vargas in the 47. Big one at the Denver Motorsports Bowl. And now coming into this race, you know everyone is new to this racetrack. And it shows there. Uh, coming back to the line. Three wide. But it really shows there. Um, so with Jack Robinson, let's take a more look at this one. Yeah, just gets into Brett Sierra there and just Mitch Collins sends him over, Carter Joey, uh, uh, Joshua Harrison, Griffin, Lynn, Ryder, Chisholm, Nathan Stapleton, spins out his teammate. Let's see who got out of that. Uh, Jose Mills got some damage, Stephen Colin got some damage, uh, that's why I'd have gotten some damage. Well, I'm boarded for Riley Spurley too. Let's see what he's on board of this DC Solar uh, Chevrolet Camaro. Yeah, he's about to get through this. Brakes, brakes, brakes. Run to do his teammate. Going for a car bell there. Wow, she was one of the few ones to actually get through that, and she got through that one on the top. So uh, very surprising to see her get through that one on the top. And let's go on board uh, with one last person. Uh, oops, as I do stupid. Uh, but, <laughs> anyways, let's go, uh, let's go to where the wreck happened. So, right here. Uh, let's go on board with Carter. Actually, let's go on board with Christian Vargas. Vargas sees this happening. Can't break in time, runs into the back of Carter Joey. That's basically all wreck in a nutshell. So the big one strikes here, uh, Denver Motorsports Road Course. Oh boy, when we say big, it's big. <laughs> so, come back with about, I want to say, five to go here at the, uh, at Denver. We're running at the Denver 300. Can Anton and Charbois lead every single lap, or will someone from second on back come in and take the lead? You see, Renato Moreno had a good, uh, seat, has had a good season. We'll fast forward a bit here. Catch up with the game. Ooh. 
Oops. Ah, uh, that is my bad. I don't... Yeah, that's, that's my bad, guys. I think we missed the uh, whole plan. Anyways, uh, sorry about that. Five to go now. Trey Smith has a chance for the lead. He will go for the lead on Anthony Tarawas. And out of two. He'll get the lead. So, new leader here in Denver. And uh, Trey Smith. Trey Smith is not happy. I do season his two car. But, uh, he's made the most of it. It's, he's going to go wide. Not too wide. Out of four, new leader Trey Smith, and I heard some wrecking, but nothing up front, so he will keep on going. Trey Smith has a big gap, you know, uh, talking about Denver last week, or yeah, last week's race, because it's uh, a week, it's been a week to the day I have recorded this. So yeah, I just, just saw no passes. I saw one pass for the league, I want to say, under me. Which is, is okay. It was a fun race, so I thought going to get Lance Smith at the end, but it was a good race. Can't fault him. Manson and Charbois, after having such a great car, pulls back all the way to third. Now look at look at the top. 209, 210, 212, 213. It's gonna go up all the way to about 217 and then fall off. The range of a uh, range of a uh, speed here, kind of like the Michigan, but just faster. Caution to come out. We're coming up on already two to go in the race. And Anton and Charles Wall are looking for the lead. I don't think it's going to uh, Bird on back has a chance. I don't even think Anton and Charles Wall has that good of a chance. But he will give it a go. Slows up is Trey Smith. But he won't get too much ground to be 96 or 10. 5.5 tenths at the line last time around. Light flag in the air and it's down to point, or three tenths now. About four tenths of a second off the Anthony Tarbaugh. And he makes a lot of time up in the turn uh, or in the corners. Trey Smith really heavy, breaks a lot in the corners. So that allows Anthony Charbois to gain on the two car. And going into three for the final time today. And coming out of four. I think Trey Smith has just won his first race of the season. And has become the fourth different winner this season. Out of four, Trey Smith wins at Denver Motorsports Park. Fly by the field. Caution as caution what for? Okay, Lynn. So almost a great finish for him. Caution out here late. Let's take a look at what happened. Ah, just uh dropped the test on the top thirty seven. Trey Smith wins at uh, wins at Denver Motorsports Park, and let's go down to Victory Lane. Let's take a look at the results. 
First is Trey Smith, Antoine Charbois, second, Nelson Reeves, third, Marcus Sachi, fourth, Dan Harrison, fifth, Brandon Bale, sixth, Renato Moreno, seventh, Juan Rodriguez, eighth, Cole Raymond, ninth, Lance Smith, Jr., tenth, David Hyes, eleventh, Ricky Freeman, Jr., twelfth, Christian Elder, thirteenth, Matthew Burnett, all the way from thirtieth into fourteenth, fifteenth is Rod Hayes, sixteenth, Jay Jefferson, seventeenth, William Brock, eighteenth, Diego Lopez, nineteenth, Carbell. 20th, Owen Miles. Uh, 21st, Mitchell Collins. Jose Mills, 22nd. Gil Williams, 23rd. Stephen Col Colin, uh, 24th. Finley, 25th. Audra Baranowski, 26th. Brett Sear, 27th. Roy Ribbleton, 28th. Mathis Wells, 29th. Nathan Stapleton, 30th. Joshua Harrison, 31st. Ryder Chisholm, 32nd. Carter Joey, 33rd. Riley Spurley, 234th. Peter Onjak, 35th. Roy Rivelton, 36th. Joshua Tuppensaw, 37th. Christian Vargas, 38th. Caden Lynn, 39th. Code Red, 40th. Griffin Lynn, 41st. Alright. Let's take a look at the standings. Antonin Charbois, 1st. Landon Smith Jr., 2nd. Cole Raymond, 3rd. Rod Hayes, 4th. Owen Moss, 5th. Ricky Freeman, Jr., 6th. Trey Smith, 7th. Uh, Gil Williams, 8th. Bill, Brandon Bill, 9th. Matthew Burnett, 10th. Christian Elder, 11th. Owen Finley, 12th. Ryder Chisholm, uh, 13th. Yupes, 14th. Teppensaw, 15th. Nelson Reese, 16th. Sachi, 17th. Fod Rodriguez, 18th. Renato Moreno, 19th. Carter Joey, uh, 20th. Brett Sear, 21st, David Haas, 22nd, Audra Baranowski, 23rd, Peter Onjak, 24th, Jose Mills, 25th, Jay Jefferson, 26th, uh, Stephen Colin, 27th, Dan Harrison, 28th, uh, Mitchell Collins, 29th, Joshua Harrison, 30th, Brandon Yoldo, 31st, Roy Rivelton, 32nd, Jack Rivelton, 33rd, Mathis Wells, 34th, uh, Caden Lynn, 35th, Code Red, uh, 36, William Brock, 37, Clara Bell, 38, Christian Vargas, 39, 40th, Riley Spurley, 2, 41st, Nathan Stapleton, and 42nd, Griffin Lynn. Anyways, that's the point standings. Thank you for joining me today for the Denver 300. I will see you for the next race at Richmond for the Hunt Brothers Pizza 250. Hope you guys have a good day. Hope you enjoyed the race, and I'll see you in the next one for race 5 of the season. Bye, guys.